How's it going everyone, Oathkeeper Sora here, and we are back with some more Nier Automata. In the last part, we, um, oh god, what did we do? Oh, we, um, we took down Adam, I think? <laughs> did we take down Adam with 9S's on 9S side? I think we did. Um, so yeah, we did all that, I think, and then, what, what else did we do? We, uh, oh, here's Chester. Um, we didn't really do an awful lot. I tried getting some, uh, materials for, like, upgrading stuff. Type 40 fists. Ooh, I got some new weapons. Well, I'm glad I looked behind there now. Um, so yeah, we uh, we found stuff and upgraded stuff. Uh, we upgraded the uh, uh, the uh, the spear, and I feel like we upgraded something else. Oh, the the beast lord. Even though I'm probably gonna, never going to use that sword, but oh well. Uh, so. That's interesting that we've actually got some fists. Some new fists. Uh, anyway, I think I'm going to actually stick on the uh, the spear. So, off screen I said I was going to sell all my stuff, and I did. And I came away actually with quite a lot of... Um, quite a lot of G's, to be honest. Uh, so, yeah, I was pretty lucky with that. Uh, do you know what? I'm going to keep these just in case. Um, so what I did was I bought the last, what is it, the last uh, plug-in slot that I needed. So now my my thing is completely full. So that is good times. So yeah, storage, that's the word I was looking for. My storage is completely full now. So that is good. Um, other than that, I think we just got to head off really to the amusement park now. So I'm actually just going to head off there and see what awaits us really. I haven't really done much else other than that, I think. Uh, just a stray item here, going to pick that up. Crystal. Nice. I didn't mean to do that. Woo! Oh, now we can do stuff with it. Hijack target and operate it remotely. If we do this, then I think we can, yeah, we can self-destruct it as well, which is pretty awesome. Huh. It does, I think it, it does a flat amount of 50%. I think that's still the same as uh, if you were to just like blow it up normally through hacking, so I don't think there's any real benefit to uh, Oh, hijack boost. Nice. What is that? Uh, hacking? Strength and remotely controlled enemies. Enemy plus level plus two. Oh my god, why it's so slow to get to the bottom? I'm gonna put that on. What did I take off? Did I equip it? It didn't equip. Oh, okay. Is it because I need to... Oh, it's because I need to take off? Fuck. Okay, this is... This is... This is backwards. What the fuck? So, let's... Mm. I'm just going to take off the XP gain. I already know there's an amazing way to farm XP later on. So I'll just do that later. But for now, since we are playing with 9S, let's have some hacking abilities. So like, does the enemy need to be at like full HP or something for me to like control it or what? Fuck it. Blow him up, detonate. This is what I wanted to show. Okay, so I've damaged that one a bit. So, of course when I tried to show up before, Oh, you know what? I don't... It must be that you can only take control of the enemy, like... If they're at full HP. Which kind of makes a bit of sense, I guess. Uh, okay, so... I guess I can only actually take control of enemies if they're at full HP. That's what I'm assuming, at least. So... 
So, yeah. Okay, but we can come in here. Because we've got to come down into the little sewer bit so we can like get back into the amusement park. Maybe we can get through from underground. Do you know what? I don't know how you jump off ladders. So to be, those machines out in the desert look just like androids, right? Right. But we androids were modeled after our human creators. So why would machines try to look like us? Hmm. There's just... no point trying to work oh, out no. unsolvable problems. I suppose. So yeah, another thing you might have noticed at the start of the episode, I hacked into a chest. Well, that is something only 9S can do. You probably have noticed that throughout the 2B story we were, uh, or I should just call it Route A, shouldn't I? Oh, that's, that's blocked off. I can't even go this way now. Oh, yeah, I can. There was the spear here last time, so I want to see if there's actually anything at the top. But, uh, yeah. During the uh, 2B story, there was all the, uh, oh, there's nothing here. Nah. I don't know what I expected, to be honest. <laughs> There was all the uh, the chests and whatnot, but uh, God, how the, where the fuck am I? But yeah, she couldn't open them. It always said that they couldn't be accessed right now. But uh, yeah, turns out you need to hack them with uh, 9S. So hopefully we get some good stuff. This is Tactical Support Unit Pod zero four two. Control has been assigned to two B. This is Tactical Support Unit Pod 153. Control has been assigned to 9S. Combat data exchange requested. Exchange accepted. Proposal. Data should be exchanged regularly for greater efficiency. Proposal accepted. Data will be exchanged regularly for greater efficiency. End communication. Uh, what? <laughs> what does it all mean? Was that it? Was that just saying that they were gonna pass data to each other? I guess so. Crystal obtained. Okay, tree seed. Anything back here? No, sorry. Okay. Well, we've made it to the awesome amusement park. One of my favorite areas. They were found by the machines. The machines called them treasures. Each treasure had a different shape. Each treasure had a different That sounds to me like um, they're all unique, similar to like how all humans are unique. There's no human that's the same. Now supposedly if we uh, take over this dude right here, this big guy right here, we can, uh, oh shit, we can get a lot of XP like doing this, but I think I'm too low leveled actually to to do this properly. Uh, we need to take a remote control of him, and then we just blast shit about. I think. Woo! <laughs> oh man! I feel like so slow. Uh, you can overtake that bunny thing there in the middle, but uh, you need to like be quite a high level, I think. Oh shit! Oh my god, he was about to destroy me, I think. Give me the goods. Let's blow all of these up. Woo! I'm a maniac. 
I am a menace to society right now. This poor dude doesn't know what's going on. Oh, what the? Oh! Oh, you got. Oh, my god, I got a fucking laser as well? Okay, so if you press the pod program, you do a laser. <laughs> and if you press X, that just does like a standard attack. And that's my standard attack right there. And pressing L1 does a upwards fire thing. Man, that's really awesome. Oh, really? I don't even have to do an animation to pick shit up. I can just run past it, press R2, and it just goes to me. Huh. Can I, like, just destroy myself now? Boom! Yeah, I'm not high enough level to uh, overtake that thing. Oh well. That'll do, I think. We got some new mail. So yeah, anyway, I think it's pretty cool that we get to see different like lore things and uh, different bits of story from 9S's point of view, so it's not like a complete re-going through the whole story sort of thing. Uh, this gate isn't going to open. Maybe there's another way around. Uh, same as 2B story then. So, uh, yeah, it's good to see that there's different things um, being, like, included. Uh, I'm just going to go straight to where I need to go, I think. Run, Vines, run! We're getting resistance signals from that building over there. But I do think it's quite interesting that all the machines are made with a, a different free. shape, a, a, un a, a unique shape, so, um, like, it's almost like they, like, their creators aspire to make them like humans. Oh, I can't get that chest either, okay. But I like making them unique, but, I don't know. Clown mission, you know I don't want to talk to you. <laughs> let's play indeed. There's an item back here, I'm gonna grab this. These machines are heavily armed. We'll regret it later if we let them escape. No we won't. Oh god, I got a tiny area. Tiny area. Oh for real. Oh shit. I can't get hit again. Oh, man. Oh, strafing too strong. <laughs> oh my god. He even got 51 XP. Oh god, this was such a bad idea getting in front of the cannon. No. There we go. <laughs> that thing went down pretty fast. Ooh, we got a lot of XP as well. What's this? Some kind of crystal? Analysis. It is a core fragment from the machine life form. It is similar in structure to a plant cell. A plant cell? And we can sell these to get some G's if we really want, which is useful. Okay. Got ourselves a medium recovery. Oh, I leveled up so it gave me uh, my full health. What's this? Analysis. It is a device that propels humans on rails at high speeds for the purposes of amusement. It was commonly referred to as a roller coaster. Humans sure are strange creatures. I love roller coasters! Woo! Hey, 2B? Yes? People who know me well usually call me Nice. So... Uh. So what do you think? Uh. I mean, if you want to call me Nice, it's totally okay. I'm... Oh. <laughs> she, she totally wants to call him Nines, but she's just like, ah, I don't want to look stupid doing it. <laughs> Ooh, that's not bad. Yeah. 
God damn it. Stupid jester things. Too big, just like running in circles then. Man, I couldn't get that one. Alert. Multiple resistance members detected beneath this room. Oh, Simone. Oh, I can I can hack it, just not yet. Woo. So I wonder if we're just gonna get like more info like on the boss then. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna use an item. Uh, not animal bait though. That's for sure. <laughs> I'll use melee attack up. Oh god, not me. Please not me. Oh man. It hurts. Oh, she's going back. Keep firing away! <clears throat> okay. If we take hacking damage, it'll affect our bodies as well. <laughs> Tubi! being attacked with dead androids. Wait, I don't think... Two B, I'm detecting black box signals. They aren't dead. They've been turned into weapons. All right, this ends now. My God, so many of these corpses. Oh, God. Ooh. Oh, man. Don't get hit by any of the, uh, the beams or anything. Otherwise, you'll get hacked. Analyze the enemy's hacking pattern. I'm going to try to hack it back. Keep it busy. You got it. Here we go. Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. There we go. I swear to God, if this turns out that it's uh, that stupid Gene Paul, I will not be happy. Yeah, that's really annoying. Can I, can I hack her again? Oh, I can. Okay. Oh shit, the red blocks move. Oh! Oh, that, oh god, I got fucked up. Alert. Saturation attack triggered by enemy conscious. Oh god. Failure to destroy it quickly may lead to serious damage. 
Oh my god, I'm getting absolutely annihilated now by all these other fuckers trying to hack me. Okay. <laughs> Everyone die! Oh, they're all on the outside as well. I want to try and hack her again. Oh, okay, it's giving me it's giving me a more forgiving pattern. Oh shit. Uh. Oh, there we go. Oh shit. Uh, let's, uh, I'm gonna use another uh, attack up, I think, because it looks like she's almost done for. Oh my god, I do not want to be... Oh!
Thanks well, for the assist. that was oh, depressing. You mean the hacking? No worries. Us scanners are pretty good at that kind of thing. I've got your back anytime. She became so obsessed with beauty that she lost herself. I'm sorry to be. Their circuits are fried. I think they were only being kept alive by that enemy. Oh. Mm. Well, that doesn't mean we can't get all of this stuff. Uh Just goes to show my friends that beauty is in the eye of the beholder. She couldn't force that guy or that machine to love so, her. Um, so she went insane. What is it? That machine had some pretty weird things to say, huh? It's almost like it had actual emotion. The machines don't have feelings. You said that yourself. Yeah, I... I guess. I really do like that aspect of the story, that... They both start off like, oh, they're all... They're all emotionless, and then by the end, they're just like, well... They could have emotions, and it's like, oh, they do have emotions. <laughs> uh, okay, there's nothing that way. So I guess we're getting to Pascal's village next then. Man, look how big that goddamn building is. Hostiles. I am not hostile. <clears throat> what? You defeated broken machine. You saved us. This thing is awfully verbose for a machine. We repay you. Come to our It could be a trap. Still, we should at least head over there and gather data, right? Alright, we should, nine ass. Okay, let's head to the village. This way, this way. Uh, let's pick this up. Cause why not, eh? This way, this way. You don't gotta tell me which way. I know the way. I've been this way before. <laughs> seen that before. They're sending supplies up from Earth to the moon in the bunker. There are no spare parts or fuel in space after all. Huh. Alright, let's head back to the village. That drab bracelet can sell all of this stuff, I think. Should earn us some so nice G's. Or the aliens who created them attack the bunker directly. They originally came here from outer space, right? Well, there are a few theories about that, but no one knows for sure. Hard to tell what an alien is thinking, you know? It's really weird. I wonder how long the aliens have actually, like, been dead then. Brother? Why do we have to wear undergarments? It's such a hassle. The records claim humans covered their crotches as they went about their business. Revealing one's genitals was seen as problematic. So just be quiet and wear them already. Okay. But why are we eating this plant matter? Machines don't need to eat things like this. This is a type of fruit. Our data suggests that mankind gained great intelligence from consuming fruit. So quit griping and eat it already. Alright. If that's what you want. But once we're done, can we play together for a bit? Fine. Oh, great. Then I'll eat lots of fruit. Man, the symbolism there of that apple. <laughs> Eve eating the apple. I see what you did there, game. I see what you did there. I like that we're getting they more backstory on su on stuff. Looks like they really don't want to fight. Hello. Before we begin, there's something you must understand. We are not your enemies. To be. We can't trust anything the machines say. I understand that you see us as the enemy, but... Well, anyway, my name is Pascal. I'm the leader of this village. Those who reside here desire nothing more than to live a peaceful existence. Look around for yourself. You'll see that it's true. 
I'm gonna hack to uh, Pascal. Nope, no, I'm not. <laughs> um. Well, I guess I guess that's that really. I mean, I don't think there's really too much more to do here. You know, we already have something of a relationship with you androids. In fact, I'm hoping you can take this to an enemy. Oh yeah, I remember. We gotta <clears throat> take the fuel filter back to her. We can do this, my friends. We can do this. Obtained fuel filter. Um, I guess we will do that on the next part, maybe. Do I want to do this? Do I want to do it right now, though? I don't know. Yeah, I'll do it. No, I'll do it now. I won't take that one. Oh, it's over here. I was wondering then. I was like, where the fuck's the other end exit? <laughs> <clears throat> okay. Let's go. And can see all the quests now. I don't think it matters too much picking up quests because, like I said, there's a uh, good XP grinding spots. Although I know you can get different um, different items and stuff from doing the quests, which is uh, useful at least. Operator two one zero to nine S. This is your regularly scheduled contact. I have something important to discuss with you today. What is it? Our maintenance team filed a complaint about how you treat your flight unit. Okay. Hang on a second, let me just get some uh, animal bait going on here. Oh my god, I got 31 bait. They requested that you cease making unauthorized modifications. Well, I kinda had to. There's so much excess data sent to me from the satellite, it's delaying aim correction. If you have a rebuttal, you need to discuss it with maintenance. Fight it out if you must. Operator 210, out. Jeez. My operator's more prone to violence than I thought. Man, they really don't like 9S making mods. <laughs> Man, this is one way to travel fast. Hell yeah. Yeah, bring it on, big guy. <laughs> I don't think so. You ain't no match for Mr. Moose. Alright, we've made it. Let's, uh... Speak to Anemone really quickly, and then I think it's time to end this. Say, Anemone, I've got a package for you from a machine called Pascal. Fuel filter? Ah, perfect timing, we were running low. Wait, you met Pascal? Sure did. So you've been consorting with machines, huh? Just the ones in the village. They're totally harmless, and they also have the means to construct intricate devices that we can't. In exchange, we provide them with oil and other materials. I guess you'd call it a form of commerce. I see. Anyway, if you're headed back there, please take this high viscosity oil to Pascal. Viscous oil. Thanks for all you've been doing for us Like, Oh, I nearly forgot. I readied a room here for your har androids. Feel free to make use of it whenever you like. Thank you very much. And we got ourselves an impact bracer. Uh, I might sell all this stuff quickly that I was picking up from uh, heal drops. 30% chance for drop healing light. Oh, that's pretty useful. Um, although I don't really want them. As useful as I think it is, I don't want it. <clears throat> uh, what else do I... Wait, I've got two crits. Oh, I need to take them off and fuse them. Okay. Wait, where's everything else that I have? Machine oil? Oh my god, that's uh... God, a lot of this stuff sells for a lot. Although stuff like this drab, ear uh, drab bracelet and stuff and precious earrings. I think we can sell all of that. I uh, can probably sell this rose. Wow, it sells for a lot. God, these machine cores. Holy fuck. I'm rich! I'm goddamn rich! <laughs> oh, we got ourselves a trophy. Trophy, was it? Uh, at least 100,000 G's in possession. Not bad. Not bad at all. I guess I can farm from at some point if I really wanted to. If I really need them. Oh, uh, but anyway, I think that'll do for this part. Oh, or not. What do you think? <laughs> he just started transmitting to us directly. Now do you believe we're not a threat? Your mouth can say anything it wants, but you still don't have a heart. I suppose.
suppose that's technically accurate. Yes. But they have shapes. You're free to visit our village whenever you like. All right. Well, I guess we just got to go back to Pascal's village. So um We'll do that <clears throat> in the next part. So uh, thank you everyone for watching this one. In the next one, we will head to Pascal's village and probably do everything that we did in 2B story. My god. <clears throat> my, thro my throat is dying on me. <laughs> Why am I dying? I don't know. Anyway, peace out.